Hello, crafty miners, and welcome back to the world of RAR. Today we take our walkthrough tour of Monson Heights. And first up is the lobby here, which many of us have already seen in previous videos, so we're not going to spend too much time here. We're just going to go up the elevator here, and our first stop is the underground garage. So this garage design is one that was came up with by Seth Bling and I really liked it and so we incorporated it here and here we got our each stall for all our horses we got hee-haw over here and as you can see the way that this is designed even at full power the horse will be able to get out but under normal circumstances the horse will not be able to get out Oh man, we are having major lag here. It's those lights again, of course. So we're just going to ride old Hee Haw back down here. And we're going to continue on our tour. Come on, Hee Haw. There we go, boy. Okay, now if I can get out of here. Our next stop will be going up to, let's see, where do we want to go next? Let's go see what Sammy MacMan's apartment looks like. So this is Sammy MacMan's little elevator here, a little glass elevator. And I guess this is like a little foyer into his apartment. Push the button, get in the door here. And wow, what a swanky little place he's got here. I especially like his flooring. I think it's really neat. He's got the the logs turned each way and the, these windows are pretty sweet too. He's got the cobblestone there and we got the kitchen area and the dining area and the living room area here. Nice low couches looking good and here we go into the dining area at the piston table. Gotta love that. And we're gonna go over here and here's the kitchen. He's used pistons in here too to to really uh, do the cabinets here and make it all look like wood surfaces. This I think is his refrigerator. And now we're gonna go up the stairs here. And here we got, ooh, that's a neat idea for crafting benches. And this is just like some big dance hall or something like that, I'm not sure. Kind of a library, I guess. Got books there. And in here, oh, this is the bedroom. Nice. Great view. I, I really like these coffee tables that he's got, or the end tables, I should say. And here is the bathroom. Love the flooring. It's like, it totally looks like uh, tile. It's just really cool. And yeah, I really like this. Oh, what have we got in here? No. Oh, well. Let's see what else he's got over here. So there's a shower and the tub and a really low toilet. Really have to squat down for that one. And I know this shower works, but the last time I flipped this switch, I made a total mess of this place. So let's not do that. Let's just go back out here and we're gonna kind of take an little look see over the the balcony here all right I really like how he's done the space here though he could add a lot more but it's really cool what do you guys think you guys should uh, give a like if you like that and uh, well we gotta go back down to the lobby to go to our next destination and that will be let's go to little owl girls elevator area and I really like this it looks kind of very retro the blocks turned like that and here we are in the apartment this is like another little lobby area and look at the end of this this is neat this is definitely a way you guys can class up some of those seats and some customized artwork oh, matches that symbol back there. Well, let's go on through the doors here. 
and here we got the looks like the entertainment center there a bathroom nice toilet toilet paper oh that's good and here's the shower oh she got the short end of the stick on this one behind this wall is all the lighting for the exterior of the building you can't see it from here but looks like uh, she kind of ran out of room on that one oh well and this part looks like it's uncompleted looking looking like it's gonna be a bedroom or something I think and out here we got the kitchen very nice look at this design guys I like what she's done with the, uh, the counters that acacia would look good and yeah now let's move on let's see well we may as well go straight to the top check out my apartment so here we are in my elevator area come out here and right away we're into the living space we got a TV and the TV area with the couch and the coffee table and and over here we got just a little eating area with a nice little light feature at the top there of course I get the penthouse so I get full windows all the way around um, my kitchen area here is this simple I've got drawers and cupboards and over here I got a freezer and a in a pantry or I guess it'd be a refrigerator no way to enter it though I don't have a button or anything so now we're gonna go over here let's check out the bathroom I got shelving in here the toilet and the toilet paper of course great view and we got the bathtub here and this one I know will work just fine awesome and yeah that's that's the gist of it we got a, a mirror there with ice yeah, close that door and we're gonna go into the bedroom here and this is very simple little area let me jump on the bed a little bit here you can overlook most of Imperial City from here here we got the library and the Tri-C Tower yeah, you can make out quite a few buildings from here. And let's see. In here is my closet. So this is where I keep all my stuff that I find. This is all my fishing stuff. And that's all my books. Random stuff. More fish. Weird. Oh, and that's from my adventure to Stony Mountain. I'm going to have to do a video on that one that was a cool little national park that Sammy Macman came up with that picture right there is one that he uh, created and sells at Stony Mountain so there we have it that's my apartment there's one other place that I'm gonna take you guys this is my private museum collection here and this is all the various items I've collected over the years and I kind of wanted a place to display it so I, I made this special little level oh it's glitching again I bet you that lighting systems coming on again so for instance this is how oh, let's just see here I just got to make sure that I got replacement glass so we got Nemo here that's the first fish ever caught in the world of RAR and over here we got uh, an axe that's one of the originals from the age of survival here the sword of rar another relic of the past and these are all original items that were crafted when we were doing survival on this map we obviously have gone to creative and original fishing pole and iron hoe I don't think I ever used that thing Cheers. Yeah, we got it all here. And what else? We just got various fishes in here. 
records that we found. This one's kind of cool. It's called Squid Gummies. This is something Sammy MacMan came up with for a candy store. Um, here we got... Oh, this is the original tag for Hee Haw down in the basement there. And some of you might recognize this hard hat from the Jersamic Park video. Mamma Mia, that's another horse that we got. Or actually, I think it's a, a donkey. And let's put that away now. And so, this is a nice little portrait here. And we just got to make sure the close, coast is clear here. And here's the secret. Boom. <laughs> there we have it. The secret, secret stash here. So this is where I keep all my various items that I've obtained and of course got my ender chest and yeah it's all just nicely disguised so that's that's this level and yeah that pretty much wraps up this little tour that we've taken of Watson Heights uh, I guess we'll just come up here for a minute and this is a level for Lord and Lady TNT, D, and they haven't quite got to doing anything here yet, it looks like. So, we're just going to fly up here. You guys may have noticed the trap door in Sammy MacMan's apartment. That's what it's there for. And so we're just going to go back down to the lobby have one last look at it there we are looking good and we're just gonna go outside and we're gonna do a little flyby at Monson Heights here and so you guys can see this fabulous Art Deco building a building I found on Pinterest and it was just so awesome to make and I love it well guys that about does it for this episode Please leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed. It helps us out uh, greatly. And much appreciated on my part. And we hope you have some inspired Minecrafting ideas based off of these videos. And, and the World of Rar blog, make sure you go check it out. And even our Pinterest account. You'll get lots of ideas, I'm sure. Well, until we meet again my crafty miners. Have a great night and happy crafting.